The Asheville Tourists had a magical first half of the season, posting the best record in the South Atlantic League and one of the best marks in all the minors. A lot of reasons for their success, but Jared Fialco says one major contributor, a certain Canadian teen pop sensation. In the midst of a first half South Atlantic League playoff race, the Asheville Tours didn't so much have pennant fever as they did beer fever. And if you step into the Taurus clubhouse, you can clearly see that these symptoms are severe. From the start of the season, we try to come up with a kind of a winning song. Whenever we, we win, we play a certain song after the game because that's when we're allowed to play music after a W. And we chose Never Say Never by Justin Bieber. song is just just sever, says everything for this team we we never say never toward, towards the end of the game no matter what the score is we had a lot of comeback victories this is the reason we won the first half and so we were able to go buy a cutout somewhere and and have a mascot so to speak now he lost his head though in the celebration of greenville right he did uh you know we came in and popped champagne and there and the, and the floor was nice and wet and we gave him a tarp slide and i remember my first beer too <laughs> <laughs> yeah he probably hadn't been hadn't had many we're gonna figure this part out of the equation and we're gonna mike Get a female companion for the second half. Selena Gomez? Could be. Quite, that I would make the most sense, right? I would go with Jennifer Aniston, but that's little, a little that's difference. Have you become a fan of his music throughout all this? Like you know, I really wasn't a Justin Bieber fan until uh, we played it on the locker room about 47 times in a row. Would you call yourself a believer? I'm a Weeber. <laughs> and I am. It's coming out with a new album, Believe, you know, we're gonna we're gonna give you some props, so maybe you send some back. Retweet us, alright, Beeps? You know that this morning I was at the gym as were the tourists. Yes. And they a lot of them had on their iPods. Never would I ever think <laughs> one of them, any of them, would have been listening to Justin Bieber. But you know what they want? They want him to sing the national anthem. And if they get that, that would be something. That, that's a lead story. That's a story. <laughs> yes, that is a story. <laughs>